Hey there, boys and girls. Um, I'm just making a quick video. I'm actually doing a two-parter. First part is going to be showing off the features. Second part is going to be how it all works. So what we're seeing here is uh, just uh, Cody uh, or XBMC, however you want to call it, running with the Eminent skin. Um, so most of these features will be very familiar to you, like movies and TV shows. There's like two here, Steam and Emulation, which are different. Steam is pretty straightforward, like if I open it. By the way, I'm controlling this all through a uh, Xbox One controller, which feels pretty nice. Um, just launches Steam into big mode. Uh, just as you would expect Steam to launch into, into big mode. Uh, and if I exit it, or I'll just return to desktop. You can see it just reopens XBMC. So actually when you launch Steam, it closes XBMC and opens Steam. So like if you had something running in the background, like a movie or a, or a show, it'll close that as well. You can also opt it not to, but I find it, find it pretty, pretty useful because if you're running some high-end game, you don't want something else in the background running anyway. The other part's emulation. What this does, it launches Advanced Launcher. And that in turn gives you uh, access to a bunch of different emulators. These are all tied into RetroArch. I'll, I'll go into the details in the, uh, in the second video. But basically what this does, is just as you might imagine it, you can uh, just pick up a game and play. This is uh, MAME emulation. Let's just um, well, take a classic here. So what it just does is it launches um, RetroArch with uh, whatever extra you put into it. As you can see, it has a. Uh, well, it's, it's nice to note this one uh, has the. Uh, like a real old arcade cabinet overlay. At least it looks like one of those old slanted monitors. But if we, um, if we exit that and go into. I don't know, maybe Game Boy Advance, that might be fun. Here we go. Um, and then let's just pick a game. A bit of a I've been playing that. As you can tell, I've put a uh, it's called a low res LCD filter over it. It's when playing this, it really reminds me of my old Game Boy Advance. Only difference is I can play this on a big TV. <laughs> but as you can hear, and it just looks and sounds and plays exactly like uh, what it used to. Let's just uh, uh, sensitive 31. Do that then. We'll still get damage, but not as much. So anyway, that's the um, simulation part. So the beauty of all of this is I can just be sitting on my couch watching a movie, and when the movie's done, and I'm feeling like I don't know, playing some Star Fox or something, I can just go in Star Fox, and it just starts playing. The great part being. I don't have to do anything special. I don't have to get up. I don't have to change anything. Just launches it all automatically. Just love that thing. Especially Falco's face. Um, yeah, so that's it for um, for part one, just a demo. And uh, next video, I'm just going to go into the details about setting this up, which uh, you might be more interested in.